footballers. The time was, not that I know much about it, when it was a great game. The men were men, and then the wall, they stood like that, protecting the important things in life. Now it's this. Ooh, my my hair, my my hair, because I just had it done. <laughs> However, my guest tonight is from those olden days. He would drive a large Mercedes to a fight, and occasionally during that fight, a game of football might break out. <laughs> He's now an actor, and he's got his own fly-on-the-wall documentary series. Ladies and gentlemen, Vinnie Jones! <laughs> Vinnie, how are you? How are you? Have a seat. Ah. Now, as I understand it, you still hold the world record for being sent off in a game of football, don't you? Because it's five seconds, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, this was... I ran on and it was like a minute. No, you've done it in five seconds. That's quicker than well, a minute. Well, no, about a second, I was like, yeah. One it was, second. came on, yeah. And... You see, I'm intrigued, not being a footballist, I have to admit. How do you reach an opposing player to commit some kind of atrocity in that time? Because if they blew the whistle, I'd need a minute and a half to get... <laughs> and I sort of worked it out that as the ref looked at both... Uh, goalkeepers, as he put the whistle to his mouth, I set off. So as he actually blew, I was crossing the line at full speed. <laughs> and when they knocked it to each other, and then the whites of their eyes saw me coming at them, it was quite hilarious. It's just such a... It's like, blow the whistle now. Bang. Vinnie Jones book now. Yeah. It's such an achievement. Anyway, let's talk about your driving days. Um, what was your first car? I came back from Sweden, actually, and, and I had a bit of money from playing in Sweden and signed for, for Wimbledon. I bought a red Cortina. Ooh. Yeah. Which Beauty, Mark? Mark IV. A Mark IV? And uh, in them days, Wimbledon obviously were very basic. And myself, Dave Besson and the physio, we went there. And of course, I wanted to drive. And we took the, the, the team kit with us. And we get to the Chelsea gates and they're saying, no, you're not coming. I said, well, I'm one of the players. And by the time he had finished telling us we couldn't come in, it had overheated and just poof. And there was <laughs> the smoke and everything was coming through the vents. The light was hilarious. So we ended up pushing it down the, the ramp, taking the kit out, pushing it in the car park, and, and it stayed there. I don't know what happened to the old red court. Probably still, because they've redone Chelsea now. Yeah, I'm sure. He's Ken Bates prob has probably nicked it. <laughs> <laughs> well, have a look for him running around in it. You're over in America a lot, obviously, these days. Mm. Do they have the first idea what you are, who you are? <laughs> Well, they, I sort of get more credibility, or they come and talk to you when they realise that you was a footballer. You know, they come soccer, oh, you was a, as they'd call you, you. A soccer player. Yeah. So yeah. Because you've, I mean, Nick Cage, you were in uh, Gone in sixty seconds, good car film. Yeah. Um, is he a car nut? Yeah. He used to come. It used to be quite funny. He used to come down to work, come come on the set, and he'd come in and say he's Bentley, and then a Ferrari would turn up, and then a great big motorbike would turn up, and he'd come out and. And then when we'd finished filming for him to go home, he'd stand there and we'll slight go down. Oh, yes. <laughs> and we, he actually went on his motorbike one day and we were pulling out and we tried to follow him up to um, up the uh, motorway and he was just tush, 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 gone on the motorbike. But it must be great for him, you know, with a crash helmet on the Yeah, yeah. no one knows who he is. And Lockstock, of course, started it all, didn't it? Yeah. Because you know the scene, the very famous scene of you with the car door? Yeah. What was going through your head when you were doing that. Well, this I, is I, I first... can't say it on air, I'd probably... I'll, I'll Whisper it to sued you. ...sued again. <laughs> the thing is, though, we were thinking, that P6, big heavy doors in those days, yeah. good for smashing a man's head in. Modern cars, we're not no. so sure, actually. So can you just pass us our prop? I think we've... the windows would go now on the... Exactly. We've had, imagine this, <laughs> right, yeah. we've all seen Day of the Jackal, OK? Now, if you could come with me, Vinny, because what I want you to do is try and smash this in the door of one of our cars. Oh. Come with me. Down here, everyone. Gather round. We're going to this smart car. Oh. Which is made of plastic, OK? Hasn't got to go back, has it? What? Hasn't got to go back. Yeah, it has. What I'd like you to do is famously reenact the scene. If you go on the well, other side. You should side put of it in door. from the other side. The, it was actually a block of wood in Lockstock. Well, it's a watermelon in this. Yeah. Right. It's also very so we'll heavy. Try and, yeah, yeah. So, here okay. we go. OK. Ready? Yeah, here we go. Not bad, in wrong. <laughs> so, so a little bit of um, the day of the jackal, a little bit of lock stop, a little bit of top gear, all in one. Um, now, of course, you haven't just come here to. Can you hang on to that? 
Cheers, mate. Um, <laughs> do the garden. <laughs> yeah, sadly, do the garden. You haven't just come here to smash watermelons to pieces, obviously. Yeah. You've uh, you come to do a lap on our track. You went with the Steg, obviously. What was that like? Yeah. Um, when the backside stops retracting, I'll let you know on that one. He is quick, isn't oh. he? OK, but it is time now to see how you got on in your lap. This is the, uh, the power board, OK? I These just want to beat... Jonathan Ross, I've got to beat Ross. Jonathan here. Ross, 1 minute 57. You could have strolled, mate. <laughs> Shall we see how he got on? The star in the reasonably priced car. Play it. Ooh. <laughs> nice star. Cheers. Come on, girl. Looks very Make slow. It seemed a lot faster when I was doing <laughs> it. <laughs> no, well, it is a Suzuki Liana. It's not a fast car. <laughs> This is the bit, though. You can scrub speed off here. If you lose speed here, you'll never get it back all the way up the main straight. This is, this is the home bit, this little, uh, this little bend here. This is where everyone goes off. How do you, how do you manage? Steady, Vin. Boot it. She kept it on the island. And that was where Michael Gambon nearly rolled it. I and you're across that, yeah. the line. Seemed a bit slow, I think. I've been told the time. Go on, man. You want to be faster than Jonathan Ross? Yeah. I pity Jonathan Ross if you aren't faster than him. I see will not let me. Vinny, J, one minute, 50. 51. Three. 53. So you're in there, faster than Ross can. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Vinny Jones.